I'm Graham Parker, I'm Head of Technical for Story Homes in Cumbria and Scotland. Story Homes are more a uh, north development. Um, we have developments in the northeast and the northwest, as well as Cumbria and some sites in Scotland. Story Homes have done numerous sustainable drainage schemes in the past, and then when we met with United Utilities, they were looking to go down the route of adopting sustainable drainage systems. So we wanted to jump on board with United Utilities to work with them to start looking at some early adoptions of schemes because sustainability is important to us as a, as a developer. Um, so it was the most environmentally friendly solution um, that we can provide for the development as well as being a cost effective solution for engineering. What it does, it helps achieve, for one, a, a good solution for dealing with surface water. So we're not having to put that into the mains drainage system, so that relieves the pressure of that on United Utilities systems. But it also creates a really good environment for customers with nice open spaces, so providing we put them in the right place, there can be an asset, there can be a saleable feature for customers to see, rather than look at other housing uh, around it, so it creates that nice open space. And it also helps the ecology and the landscaping in the area as well. First of all, you've got to provide the space for it, and that's the first challenge. But if you develop it into your concept schemes early on, and you get all the stakeholders involved in those discussions, so United Utilities, Lead Flood Authorities, the Environment Agency, if you get all those involved early on, then it doesn't become a challenge, it becomes part of the scheme itself. And that's why I think working with United Utilities early on helped us you know, work together to be able to come up with something that both sides are happy with in terms of them taking it over for adoption and us being able to hand something over that's safe and has got a long-term management plan in place. Everything went really well, uh, checklist went well, we through the adoption side of things. That site has just recently been adopted by United Utilities. It's equally important to Story Homes to have sustainable developments and create an environment that's friendly. We like the idea that we can provide something that's soft engineering rather than hard engineering, something that can be nicely landscaped and encourages ecology and wildlife. It all generates interest for future residents of development as well. I think it's important that it goes back to the planning, the early planning stage. Make sure you're planning your SUDS feature so that you can create a successful master plan and integrate that into your master plan so that it becomes part of the development, not tucked away. That's hidden away as a feature because that's something that creates an unattractive environment and w would fail as a, as a sustainable uh, feature of a development. It should actually take care of itself and develop its own natural environment and, you know, with, with a small amount of maintenance, it'll continue making that an attractive feature for the future.